Something that Linux applications seem to be rediscovering lately, I think, is the HUD as a way to be more productive with your apps. And I think it's really a nice way. So this was recently implemented in a lot, almost all of KDE applications through, through a component, which is called, obviously because it's KDE, is K command bar. So how this works is that you use a shortcut, which if I remember correctly is control shift I, and you do see this HUD to appear and you can search for whatever action and it also has all of the shortcuts so that you can actually use them. And I love it. I absolutely love it. I've also seen that it's being implemented in Inkscape and uh, I think it's a great component to know what uh, you have as possibilities in your applications. Like I think that most people wouldn't know if I told them how to enable block selection mode. And by just by doing this, you just open up the command bar and you just search for block selection and you also get the shortcut on the right. Does Gnome have this? And there is this plugin, which is called Plotinus. And the idea is this, it is a searchable command palette. And to install this, you install a couple of packages, of course, but you also um, in a git clone repository and you easily build it. It's super easy to do. Then you export JTK3 modules with the path of the .so that it has been uh, installed. And it's pretty easy to see where it was installed, installing user local lib, lib .so. And you add this either before the application or to your etc environment, and that's it. Let me actually show you an example. I opened up Setzer with um, the LaTeX editor uh, with this plugin, and if I type Control Shift P, this appears. And it has lots of options, and of course, depending on how uh, how many actions does does the application actually register, it depends on them, but you do see many of them. As an example, we do have a new LaTeX Late document and all of the Windows functions with also on the right, the shortcut. And it's actually impossible to close this by clicking anywhere else, but I gotta say that I'm really happy to see this also because uh, oh, it looks gorgeous and it it's really, really similar to the implementation uh, of the key command bar, which I think came later, I'm not saying anybody copied copied anybody. The HUD is a concept that was there before, but it's becoming a common idea that you can just actually rely on this behavior because if this having this command bar is an exception, then you will end up forgetting about it. Whereas if all of the application can actually enable this, it's something else completely. So what do you think? Save current sessions, document, Got a lot of stuff in here. Set one document as root, yes. Geometry, I can even search for the document name. What do you think of this? The, would you use it? I think it's a pretty cool thing and I would like all apps to have it.